Praise the Lord in my one of my favorite spots on my personal perch <laughs> and my supernatural soapbox. As I try to pull so many from the pit. And I believe that's why it's called a pool pit. Because we're to pull people from the pits uh, from whence we came. There's so many pits I can pull you from because of life and said experience and sad experience. I can pull you from the pit of anger, bravado, BS and chaos, calamity, crisis, demoniacs, demons. Uh, I can pull you from the poor pit of ego, egotistical, evil. I can pull you from the pit of faithlessness falsities, fallacies. I can pull you from the pit of anger, aggravation, uh, agitation, aggression. Who have you pulled from the pit? As I leave this alone. One of the saddest things I've ever seen in my own life, and I've seen a lot, growing up in a concrete playground, in the inner city, in the projects, low-income housing, the ghetto, whatever you want to call it, as I leave this be. But it's sad to say I love her so much. And to mistreat her on the same level. I love him so much. But to mistreat him on the same level. My mom and dad had an old saying. You can't shoot me and operate on me. You can't cut me and sew me up. You can't hurt me and heal me. That is so selfish to be with someone. Who you won't treat right. Talk to right. But you're mistreating and come home to. Won't touch, won't talk to right, won't respect. But you love her. But you love him. So selfish. You won't set them free. And if they try to get away, you turn up the heat. If they leave you, you put the car on flat. You won't pay the mortgage. You won't pay the rent. You try to destroy them with their own parents and family. Some of y'all are guilty of this. Certain of y'all. And I'm certain of this as I leave this alone. But how many people are that selfish, heart selfish, emotional selfish, mental selfish, uh, uh, spiritual selfish, physical selfish, uh, uh, verbal, moral selfish to um, mistreat a person. You love them so much. You won't let them go, but you mistreat them on the same level that you love them. Hmm. Something very, very deep to think about. If you love me, treat me right. When I get ready to leave you. Uh, you, you don't act like you're missing me a bit. But then when I'm gone or, or then left or estranged or divorced you, then you miss me. Something, something just ain't right. Hmm. You can't love me and hate me on the same level. No man can serve two masters, for he shall uh, love one and hate the other. So make up your mind. Do you love her? Do you hate her? To be or not to be together? I don't know. To be married. Do you love him or do you don't love him to be with him or not to be with him? But you can't love a person and mistreat a person and be with a person on the same level. One got to give or one got to yield to the other. Deep message. Peace. One.